and welcome back to another Modern Sky Block 2 with Lano. Started just another episode, so yeah, we're just gonna smash it out, continue on. Um, yeah, I think we have enough of everything to make another one. If we don't, oh uh, well, we'll cry. Uh, oh, we need sand. Oh, you, you mean. You just mean, bro. I forgot about that. So we go like this, and we need two more. So that two more is actually quite a few of these. I mean, you think four times two? That's a lot. Ah. There we go. Enough now. And we should be good to make. 27, see? Uh, we go put this down. Now, I'm actually going to build it here. I mean, the LA Kiln is pretty cool, but yeah, I'll just move it. And this is an easy block to make. jump or we'll place at the right time and then we go BAM and we've turned you into a second one of them and then we just grab half of this and whack into there now we need some piping so we can auto pipe out the uh, create so oh hopefully I've got enough piping um, where is that other servo I thought I had a spare servo, I guess I don't. So I'll need some glass. I'll need one of you, three of you. And do I have glass lying around? I do not have any glass. Huh. Yeah, just take that. Servo. So, where did I put all the redstone? All the way over here. Oh, we must be out of glass up here. Nope, just cook, taking too long to cook. I was thinking of actually um, adding two or more of the crucibles on each side and then piping it straight into the fluid tank. I reckon that would speed it up. If not, then I don't know. You don't need hardened stuff yet for this, or at all, because it's just slow. So one, and then we run it over here. Hmm. I really want to move this into the middle. I don't know why, I just like things to be symmetrical. So, and that means I need to break the glass. Actually, no, if I leave it there and build around it this way, we'll be good. So, break, 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 break. <laughs> we lift the chest up. And we put the breaker there. Go and then Have that back, please. Oh, really? Okay. Gotta be 
be quick about this. Yeah, shotgun quick. And there we go. Simple but effective. I am who I say I am. There we go. So if I ever take the tank and bring it back. If I ever take the tank and bring it back, I can just put it down there and it'll fill it up while doing this and it'll be all good. So, and with the steel, see the steel's coming along, I just need a little bit more. So, uh, I'll probably have to make more of these later so they all actually work or work a lot quicker because they do take some time to cook down. See look at that. See that one percentage took a while so I'll just let that go. These will cook hopefully the rest of that and the rest doesn't matter on that if it wastes its burning. But we really need a lot more charcoal to make for not charcoal, coal coke to enter the um Tinker stuff, so we must be full on wood. We are. Damn, check that out. This is what I wanted to see, and they're all halts because of the output here, and that will just fill up with trees, so I don't mind. We will have unlimited wood, so, and the saplings, and that are just side effects, and that's what we wanted. Well, that's what I wanted. What about you guys? Oh, I'll put that away because we'll probably never use it because we have uh, this here to use off of. I don't know if it's actually quicker, but eventually we will have other things um, making it for us. So uh, uh, thermal expansion will probably have the induction smelter. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. So, just put all this away and then work on our next project. Well, still pushing towards it. I mean, we should work out how much coal we get. <coughs> You're probably saying it would be quicker to break it down, but in reality, it wouldn't matter which way you go because times that by nine, one block, and it will give you your answer how much you need anyway. So. Now, what I wanted was a range collector. So what do we need for this? So we could actually make one of these because we have everything. So we'll make get two impregnated sticks. I do not have a hopper, so I don't have any iron. I really should keep this stuff over there, at least a stack. So an iron, we'll keep the redstone, we'll keep the copper, we'll keep tin. Yeah, that'll do for now. So away. Click on them because that will give it our hopper. Uh, we needed a casing. And we needed the black quartz, which is to a U, and we needed some iron plating, which is not here. Did I put the iron plating somewhere else? I did. I am stupid. Okay, so that should do to make another iron casing. We have two ender pearls here and we need this which is just a piece of charcoal. Uh, sorry, not charcoal, coal. Uh, I think I have, I do. Let me drop this bad boy in just because I can. Let me come over to here there and there we go 
this is uh, one range collector this is for the smeltery so see that's easy quickly to get this done usually I would do something else actually I might um, automate Botania a little bit because this needs to generate mana and I can actually make a proper armor set so might do that so we need a dropper and uh, what is the dropper called from Botania because I would like to keep it roughly Botania ish uh, open crate that's what it's called and you need living wood planks and then for the living wood planks you needed I know you needed some of these do I still have my axe and I really should create a tinker's axe to make my life easier um, and didn't I have see so I only got four We'll make some of these and we'll put a pressure plate here and drop it right above it and then redstone up to tell it that it's you know full this is full comparator up and around should be 15 from there or 14 ish and then that will keep dropping um, uh, coke uh, coal coke or oh, actually charcoal because charcoal um, will sit on the floor for a while. Uh, if I use coal coke, it will burn. It will take too long, and it will start disappearing. So I need to remember how to do that because it's been a while since I've actually played with Botania. I've been playing a lot of tech-related mod packs, so Botania hasn't been in them because it's not a tech mod; it's a magical mod. So. I went to go look to see uh, if they had the new texture mod for Botany and unfortunately they haven't updated that one. That's the problem with coming out with new packs, they take too long to update their resource packs. So I'm waiting. So a lot of people that actually maintain their mod packs have stopped making them because they've made them for 10 years ish maybe. So considering 1.7.10 is where they made a lot of them and then they've just over time as the developers added or removed um, items they have to add and remove those items from the packs as well so it kind of sucks and it takes I don't know how long it takes to draw because I cannot draw for the life of me draw color in or anything so and I know 8-bit looks terrible but Unfortunately, there's not much we can do about it. I mean, you, you look at this 128-bit uh, texture pack compared to this. I mean, Vasky has done a really good job at doing this. She has done an excellent job, but I just prefer the high-definition packs. Graphic snob, yes. Uh, but then again, I do play older ga or other games that have crappy graphics, but I still love them. That's, that's it. So, um, and to make a plank, it's four, and I need two of them. And there is our open crate. And I need a pressure pad. I wonder if I can. Probably can't, so I'll just do it normally. And I dragged it too far across. There is our pressure pad. Oh, also I'll need. I think it's. And what can I make? Is there anything simple to make? I mean, I could make them out of there, out of the blocks, but yeah, I'll just use just use your stone. So we want to, we want that to be there. I'll actually make it out of this one first because I usually get it wrong. Um, then you want and when you 
stand on it turns it off then we want another one and I think it's like that I, I think I haven't done this for a while so I know how I remember how it goes I think it actually needs to be one more higher because that should turn it should allow it to drop from memory. I need actually a hopper. Because <coughs> you need to put it directly into so I'll have to cook some up. Oh wait, already did. So, oops. Okay, these See? It's not, it's, there we go, look at that, I did remember it first time. See, and they just sit there, and then I'll get a comparator, and then I'll come down, uh, actually down here, and then wrap it around, and hopefully if it's not 15, that's fine, because the pool only roughly needs to be close to full, because I won't put the terrace steel plate and everything down just as yet but I'll have it out this way and I'll have a few mana pools to fill up so that will just feed to those mana pools and then that mana pool will go off to the terrace steel so but these are all happy these will actually just continue on feeding these so I'll quickly make a comparator hopefully I've got enough quartz I have three I don't know what I need for a comparator only need one. Well there you go then. And three redstone torches. So, one, two, three. Let me do that. Redstone comparator. Okay. This will tell us actually how much there is in the mana pool. Uh, there you go. Uh, or not. Is that the right way? We'll find out. Get power of 1. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Look at that. That is just marvellous. That that will actually... This will fill up to 15. So we, it will get to a point where it may lose a tiny bit and then it will drop two more. But this will fill all the way up to 15 because max is 15. So I actually might have to. I don't know because I don't know if this counts as one. So we'll just wait anyway because this will take a while to go through. I'll just have to cook up a lot more um, charcoal. So. So, oops. And I actually wanted to, don't I?
just work, just... Ah, they seem to can't do much without me. And... Okay, so... Apparently they can't log on to a server. Okay, let me just bring this up. Sorry for the delay. But I have to fix it because my partner is crying that he can't log into a server. Hope he doesn't watch these. He'll he'll tell me off. Or he'll laugh. Um let's see. Apparently, we'll, we'll see what he says. The password is correct. I hope you don't see that. <laughs> uh, what are we at? 21 minutes. I'm just qu I'll quickly rerun through and have a think. But I don't think uh, Bandicam changes to um, a different screen when you click on it. It locks it. Uh, can't log in. Really? Fine, I will just go... And I will just try and re-log in... See if it was my end with the password... Okay, um, oh, I'm back anyway, that's been fixed. Okay, um, the joys of actually being an IT administrator. So, anyway, you had fun for five minutes watching me. Usually I don't work at night time, but tonight, as I said in the last episode, I had to create a internal network for our VLANs and we, we lived in, well they live in two different uh, data centers and I was trying to connect them together and after reconfiguring everything then I got told that one's in one data center and the other's in the data center, well actually I didn't get told, I worked it out because a couple of nodes wouldn't work, fixed them and it broke a lot of other stuff and they have to be reconnected to the internal network or not the internal network, the, the network interface so they're all jumping up and down and yelling at me for doing this but I was told that it had to be done but the side effect was restarting about 1400 programs across um, god how many nodes was it? 30-ish? So, it's a lot of work, but hey, they they wanted to do it, and we have um, um, interns, not interns, um, uh, people that do this stuff for us, so... I don't know what he is. So, I may have to cut this episode a little bit short, because one of the programs will not work so it shouldn't be too hard to fix I'll have to log in and have a look um, anyway I was going to throw this in here so I think I might put a hopper on top of that and what I pull it in and pull it out of it so these will end up in their own little 
areas eventually, well new ones will, so I can do this a little bit easier. Um, I think we may be out of glass now. We've still got 14 copper left. I think that's enough copper. I, I really think that is enough copper. So what's next on the list? More iron. So let's check this out. Yeah, we need more glass. So... So it'll be easy enough just to uh, pull it out into a chest right here, straight in. I think I might do that. <coughs> Need to create some more of these. Uh, that one. Don't want to accidentally put them back into the, uh, my bags. We'll split this here. Ooh. That's right, I keep forgetting. This needs to be put on there, and that needs to be done there. And done. And up that there, and that there. This, this this just brilliant gets rid of it easily no hassles so and you can still do it oops so, so yeah good way of getting rid of your liquids Okay, um, so basically it's a waiting game and me just filling in these episodes at the moment to do with this stuff. I think I might, um, actually, I should make a farm area as well, so just plant up some stuff. I probably won't even really use it, so it's just basically growing stuff. Um, that over there does a uh, heap of bone meal, so actually... Do, we'll do this. We'll, we'll set this up to auto fill up with water. Um, so that's our next episode because we've only got a couple of minutes left on here, and we will get it to automatically fill this up with water. And yeah, so we'll get it to fill with that stuff. Um, this is running nicely. So yeah, it's still only at one percent. Well, at one. So this must be all connected yep they're all connected to that that's connected to that so we must be uh, see we got some manner in there so it is taking its time so we'll have to see how long this takes because we may have to break it off here so we'll see anyway um, yeah see? Ooh, what's that? Uh, there. Ooh, soul gem of skeleton. Don't even know what they're used for, but it looks good. Might actually make some hardened ones so we can upgrade to a three. Oh, uh, upgrade to a three. Upgrade to a hardened so we can have six in there. And the hardened one is, uh, I know, nickel. So we'll need more nickel. Oh, we'll need more. No, we need to create nickel, zinc, and nickel, which is just glowstone and iron. So that's actually pretty cool. So uh, we don't need much of it. So let's just go with four, four and four. And we need a lot more glass. So let's get rid of this. I forgot that was in there. And we'll do this one and this one. While we wait, I'll put all this away. So all this can go in here. Um, that's for there's our coal coke which we are doing. Um, so we got plenty of dirt now, and I'll put these over here. Separate them. 
So that's good. Um, so there we go. We got nine nickels, so that's not too bad then. So we'll put that in actually now. Um, did I? I did not. So anyway, it is wrapping up point for us. So what I will do is I will crash up this, get some gra uh, glass. I'll wait probably about half an hour before I actually start my next episode. So this catches up and a few other bits and pieces, and you know. So I uh, will see you guys later um, in the next episode. So later.